guys, this is my welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to a Kane Brown concert. It's early. I haven't woke up this early in like a fat minute. Time is currently 6.59. I woke up like 30 minutes ago. This is my first time really waking up early for a concert. Besides Nessa Barrett. Me and my mom got VIP tickets. I actually surprised her with the tickets back last year in August. I remember saying we have a whole freaking year until we see him. Now here we are, the day of. Check-ins at like 4.15 I think, or 4, no 4.15 or like 4 p.m. Um, we're gonna leave my house at like 9, we're gonna go to Cane's. Or I wasn't gonna get Cane's up until like a few weeks ago. I was like, wait a minute, Cane's? Like Cane Brown, so I'm like, good idea, right? That, that might just be stupid, but I think it's a good idea. I'm gonna eat Cane's before seeing Cane Brown. After that, then we're gonna head on the freeway. Then I'm gonna go to Air One because I wanna try Sabrina Carpenter's new smoothie called Short and Sweet. Her album is so fire. I hope the drink is fire. I'm very picky, so I don't know. This drink is $23, so <laughs> I don't know about all that. Anything for Sabrina. And then after that, then we're gonna head to the, what's it called? Stadium. So we should get at the stadium at like one or two. Hopefully not too late because we're trying to get front row. That's our itinerary. Our itinerary for today is that is that the right word i don't know i'm trying to be smart here we're gonna fix myself up we're gonna leave in about two hours so yeah, we're gonna fix my hair fix this outfit and yeah i'll see you in a bit oh before i fix myself up i just wanted to show you because yesterday i went shopping for my outfit literally very last minute i went shopping head to toe the only thing i bought ahead of time was my shoes is very stressful, took six hours. Here's that footage. Wait, okay, this I might get. Wait, how much is it? Um, I already have a cowboy hat, but I want to get it for my mom. <gasps> look, they have boots here. Don't tell me these were cheaper. Look, they're cheaper. Oh my god, look, these are cuter. I should have got these. How much are they? Okay, $60. Oh, wait. This is literally all like a cow, cowboy, cowgirl section. Look at, okay, this is not, okay, yeah, this is ugly, but like, kind of, you know, like this, but like more firm. Oh, look at, I kind of like this, but, oh my god, that's leadless. Oh, heck no. That's what we like to see. Well, we actually really like this. I love this, but I want a brown top though. Oh, um, hello? It's kind of scary. <gasps> For this little thing? Oh. The worker just walked by. <laughs> Better paying up. This front part looks funny. Oh my god. So I think there's this new store because I've never seen it before. There's like so much stuff in here. I could already see by not looking. There's this shirt. There's this one. There's this one. There's this. There's this. This is cute too. Okay, I kind of like this top though. That store has everything, but I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna go into other stores first. I like these. Okay guys, I thought this was gonna be cute. I mean, it is cute, but like, probably not for me. It looks like a napkin, kind of. And it's not giving Kane Brown concert, you know? So I think I just should stick to the demon, demon, the denim skirt vibe. But the thing is, I don't have much time. I only have like 20 minutes until I have to leave because, because I have an interview to go to at four. The time is currently 2.34. And I have to leave an hour before it starts. So I have to leave at three. So let's go more shopping, I guess, for a denim skirt. It kind of looks like a napkin. I don't know how Natalie Cuevas eats these up. Because every time I go into Hollister and I see like a white skirt or a white dress, I think of her. Wait, y'all, this is so cute. That's cowgirl. But it's $50. Y'all, look at this. Oh my god, $50? 
This is cute. Just for the shorts? I should have guessed that this place was going to be expensive. Why don't they have brown ones? Doesn't it look like this is something Billie Eilish will wear? That's what we like to see. This is cute, but I don't like how flabby it is. Wait, I love this. Let's try everything on. This is cute. I just wish I had a heart on both sides, but it's still eight. It has a little gap, which I'm happy about because that means, you know. Wait, what size are these? 27, that means I'm like 26. I was at 28, like a little bit ago. So, eight. Okay, let's try on the other ones. These shorts are so cute. I like the buckle. But it's kind of giving slutty. It's cute though. Y'all, I saved this one for last because I thought I was going to like it the most. What is this? It looks so goofy. I, mean, I like it, but I don't like it. I think I like the slutty ones. And I have these tops, which I don't think I'm going to get, so I'm not going to try it on. Okay, I like these. Actually, oh, wait. That actually eats, or I'm just delusional, but. So I think we're gonna get it. Yeah. Finally found pants after like what, 13 years, I think? This is cute. Okay, so I just went to go get a size down, and I love them. It is getting slutty, but it's okay. I love being slutty. Oh. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Are you kind of looking right? Yeah. Okay. Eleven dollars for some shorts? I say that's a pretty good deal to me. Okay, now I'm gonna find a top. I don't know what color top I want to wear though. Either a brown corset or a white top to match my boots. This shirt is really cute. Oh my god, and that skirt. Look, something like this is really cute. Oh my god, it would totally match those jean shorts. Um, I think I ate. This is totally not in my comfort zone. Like, I do not wear stuff like this, but go big or go home, right? Finally! We took six or seven hours. Take out the hour and a half because I had a job interview. But. Hey guys, the time is currently 8.37. This is my outfit. Let's do a final OOTD. Ooh, new setup. Okay. I'm in love with this. This is my first time ever like really dressing up for a concert. I literally just throw anything on for concerts. This time I'm actually trying. And also, Kane Brown is going to be the first male singer that I'm going to see live. <sighs> I am so stupid. I feel so bad. I am dumb. He is not the first male singer that I'm going to see live. I've actually seen now Warren. He is literally my husband. I don't know how I forgot my husband. I seen him in July, the day before my birthday. I vlogged that, so. Um, anyways, let's see all with this video. Sorry, though. Let's do a little OTD. Shirt. Oh my god, I'm in love with it. I never wore something like this, so it's really out of my comfort zone. Um, at first, I wanted a brown top, but then couldn't find any cute brown tops. So top is from Windsor. I love the little details. It matches like my boots kind of, which I'll show you in a second. My shorts are from Forever 21, which were $11, which is such a sleigh. Boots are from TikTok shop. This belt is also from TikTok shop. So cute. And then this, I just thought about last night. I got it from Social Tourist. I feel like this is the first time I'm saying, yeah, this is from Target. This is from... Yeah, because usually I say the same place over and over or usually like when I'm wearing like a t-shirt like pants They're like all from Target. Not that anything's bad with Target. I love Target. Um, that's where I got my bow actually, which I almost forgot to show you It's kind of cricket, I think That's the mall fix it, but you get the point. I never really do a ring What I a ring tour. There's not really a tour just one ring, but this is from Pandora 
It kind of matches my top too. I am so excited. We're gonna take my pictures and my mom's pictures outside. I don't think I'm gonna wear this. I don't know. I don't look good in hats. I look like I work at like I'm like a Knoxbury farm worker. Not an actual person that works there, but you know, like yeah, I don't even know. Oh, I almost forgot to show you. Also my bag, which I actually got it from Kane Brown. Not actually from from the cam directly, sadly. That would have been so cool. But but since we got VIP, we got like a package with like a lot of goodies in it, so Wait, it feels so special. It feels like I got a PR package. You want to look? What's a PR package? Look at it. Guess who it is? Uh -oh. Look, look, look. <laughs> what the? What is this? It's a scarf? Look, look. Oh, hat. Yeah. Is it? I don't wear hats though. Wait, those two? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You didn't know what's in the cup? It said, it, it kept saying something like a shipment's coming and then it says King Brown. But I'm like, I don't know what it is. Because I didn't order nothing. Yeah. Oh, so you say you didn't order nothing and then when came and got shocked too? What? There's something in here. <gasps> Ooh, a CD? I forgot what this is. Oh, it's a, 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 a thingy. What is it called? A I a know thingy. the language was coming. What the? You can't lose these. These gets us in. 1993. The 93. You were born in 1993. What? Hey, Nicole. It's a hat. I don't know about hats. It's a beanie, I think. Yeah, beanie. What's in it? What's in it? Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> like a man. <laughs> See? Oh, the straight like a man. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's like right for the bag. And I'm gonna have a collection is. of these. I know you have a lot of those. We got this, a beanie, a mug, and the VIP pass, which I'll show you. The VIP lanyard, which I'll show you soon. I believe a few other things, but I can't think, so. I think we're gonna take my picture aside, and I'll see you in a bit. I'm fast as fuck, no. boy. Still fast as fuck, boy. I'm going. No, I look good. What are you talking about? <laughs> or just one kid combo? Just one kid combo? And then one three finger combo. Okay, and for the three? And for the kid combo, can it be Coke Zero? And then for the three finger, Diet Coke. Okay, anything else? And then for the kid combo, can you get, um, can I get bread with it? Through the bag. Anyways. I've had cane since March, okay. and that was the only time during the diet. Mm. So excited! I was gonna get the box combo that comes with four tenders, and it comes with toast, and it comes with coleslaw. But I replaced the coleslaw with right. extra bread. Oh. So I'm like, no, but I'm already gonna get Serena's drink. So I've been watching mukbangs this past week. Canes before seeing Kane Brown. Wait, do you always get the sauce? I always see people on the TikTok or whatever that is. Wait, what is it? Oh my god. The shorts or whatever. The thing that they be eating, they have a, a, a bucket of this or a cup of this. And it looks good, the sauce. But oh, um, I really like sauce. Me either. 
Ooh. Is it the sauce or the chicken tasting good? <laughs> I like sauce. The first time I tried it, I didn't like it. And then Wait, no, later on, I tried it again, like a and year then later. Like it. What? Then I started liking it. Mm -hmm. And I just found out mm -hmm. that it's like, I don't know for sure, but it's like mixed with like ketchup and mayonnaise or something. Or what? ketchup and ranch or something. Mmm. Mm. I've never ate before. <laughs> We've seen Kings Brown billboard thing. Wait, it's not a billboard. What is it called? Yeah. That's Just walked to the car. I'm almost halfway done with it. Definitely worth the $23. Just keep this on the dash. Make mm -hmm. sure that's visible at all times, and you're good for the rest of the night. Mm -hmm. All right. Ooh, I look like a dip ever. I look funny. I know the freaking cane bag thing is not allowed in. He was like, "Yeah, it isn't allowed in," and I was like, "Even if it's from Kane Brown himself, I didn't say it like that, but you know what I mean." I'm like, "I got it in the VIP package." He was like, "Yeah, it's not allowed in. Only clear bags." And I'm like, "Oh, okay." So my mom's taking it to the car, and I'm gonna walk to 11 because it's right across the street from the stadium. We're gonna be holding everything: my wallet, phone. All of that. I don't really know if licorice, chocolate, and soda goes together, but it's fine, you know? Oh, there. to tell you guys but the reason why we assumed or mainly i assumed my mom had a, like she like wanted him to show up but didn't like think he was actually gonna show up but the reason why i like assumed that nelly was gonna be there is because tyler don't know how to pronounce his last name but he plays in georgia florida line i call it cruise song i've been calling it since i've been calling it that since i was little i think it's called like georgia florida line or something um, but he, Tyler is the one that sings in that song with Nelly. So like, or Nelly sings in that song with Tyler. That's one reason why we assumed Nelly was going to be there. Because one, we heard that song when we're in line or going to the line. And also Tyler was opening. So we just assumed, or I just assumed that he was going to sing the Roll Your Window Down song, crew song, whatever. And my mom's been a fan of Nelly for 25 years, like over 25 years. It was like three years before I was born. So like 2000, maybe? 1999, something like that. Just keep watching the video to see someone. So happy. My mom still says this is the best day ever. <laughs> Till this day. It's been almost a week and a half later. Kane Brown, please have another concert soon in LA. Continue on with the video. Sorry. Exactly. Hi, how are you? Hi. Do you just have water? I do. Hold your and that's all for you? And also can't get the red bag of Doritos? Yeah, the hoodie's right here. 
were thinking that Tyler is like, he's an opener, but like, he's like, because they had like, you know, like, sorry, I'm stuttering. You know, like for like concerts, they have like little opening previews. Olivia Rodrigo, for example, she like was knocking and you know, like so intense for everyone else who like has this like tour. They like have like something in the beginning and then they come out. That's exactly what they did for Tyler, technically. Like all the lights got dark, everything. Like I feel like Tyler, it was his concert too. I just want to say that. This Saturday night, we want to turn up one time before we take them all the way back to 2012 where it all started for us.
Oh, that was awesome. We knew it. Yeah.
glasses, but I'm recording every single one of you right now through these glasses. So y'all are getting to see through my eyes. I want to do a super cool thing on Instagram. So if you see me looking at you, man, you got to get crazy. Y'all ready?
commented on your video.
Well, I really like the pool ball out of it.
That's why you get young with every clip. From Short Story Lava Girl. That's for you guys. Y'all give it up for my boy Kaleem one time. I'm a big gamer. We got any gamers in the house? Nah, oh, man. Y'all don't be scared, bro. Where are my gamers at? We don't got many gamers. So, in the gaming world, we all do this thing. Here we go. Oh. Can I get a higher? Neighbor and one of our good friends with us is gonna sing my wife's part. I'll give it up for my girl, Willie. 
Know this. If y'all can sing this song with me as loud as y'all can, if you know it.
Best concert I went to out of all the concerts I went to. Like literally, this was the best one. Everyone kept coming out like back to back. First the opener, Taylor, Tyler, oh. and then Khaled, Collide, Khaled, Nelly, Taylor, which is so random. Without it, I wish his wife was there, but it's whatever. Mm. <laughs> Currently 1230. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm so tired. I'm back with my camera. I was charging it for a little bit while I was posting on my Instagram. Today has been such a fun day. Probably better than I expected. I did not expect that many people to come out. Especially Tate. Taylor Lautner. I guess he just came out because the one song that he came out for is like about friends, like famous friends. Like he just brought everyone out. So that caught me by surprise. So I had a feeling Nelly was going to be there. That's the one. That's the only person I really thought that was actually going to be there. I mean, I didn't think 100%. But like, I was like, I have a feeling Nelly's going to come out. Because they like sang a song together. So I'm like, why won't they, you know? Roll the Window Down song is my favorite song. I sing that song so much as a kid. Cruise, it got my backseat. The side to the moon, maybe they'll fall down. Yeah, you get the point. So, yeah, so happy I heard the song live. I cannot be more happy here right now. But, yeah, tonight went so good. Kane Brown is so freaking hot. I'm so freaking jealous of Caitlyn. If my future husband doesn't look like Kane Brown, 
I don't want him. I need to hurry up and be the age 30. <laughs> oh my god. And I am so freaking happy. He freaking waved to me. He smiled and like waved to me. <gasps> oh my god, that's so... I could talk about this forever, bro. But I'm not going to waste your guys' time. But... Oh my god. I Literally after that, not right away. Maybe like two seconds... <laughs> pretty much right away like a few seconds later i started to cry not like actually like sobbing like <gasps> like you know but like tears were like coming down my eyes and i'm just like oh my god and at the end of the concert this freaking girl like he took off his shirt like jersey he signed it in and words sorry he signed it and everything while the shirt was still on him he like was signing it and then he like took it off all sexy and stuff and he threw it to this girl that was next to me and i'm like Bite me. Don't freaking mad. I'm still mad about it. It should have been me. I wanted to keep that sweaty jersey, but whatever. There will be next time. I'm definitely going to his next concert. His concert was by far my favorite concert ever. I could have put you guys right here. His concert was my favorite ever. Um, Probably, I've been to so many concerts. If you guys know, you guys know. I've been to so many concerts. And I've like vlogged almost every single one. I'm pretty sure everyone actually. And this one, tonight was probably my favorite ever concert not just because he's hot that's number one kane is hot two he was literally bringing out every single person for like almost every song i mean not like that much people but like it felt like a lot taylor lautner khaled wait is that even a, i don't know how to pronounce it but you know the one that sings the one that sings young dumb broke high school kids nelly Tyler was his freaking opener. He had three openers. I only knew one though, which was Tyler. And I wish Marshmallow Guy came out because he sings. I don't know if he sings in the song. Probably not. I don't think he really talks. I don't even know. But he's in this one song with Kane. Um, and I wish Becky G came out because he also she also sings with him. And also, who else sings with him? Nelly sings with him, which I'm so confused because Nelly came out for the opener, Tyler, but he didn't come out when when kane was singing this one song that they sang together well he didn't even sing the song that they sang together but like i'm just surprised because nelly was there so why not you know i'm just happy i seen kane taylor lautner freaking mm. he was my everything growing up like shark boy love a girl hello nelly i mean i'm not a big fan of him but my mom plays him all the time she been wanting to meet him for like 25 years she didn't really meet him but she's seen him kane brown knows that he's this so like I'm not just a nobody no more. Okay, but I want to show you the merch that I got before I close out today's video. Okay, so this is what I got for myself. I got me this hoodie. It says King Brown in the air, which is the name of his tour. I'm definitely going to his next tour. Stay tuned for that. I'm not going to hesitate to buy the tickets because I did not hesitate to buy this one. So, and then the back, I love the back. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see it very well, but it like... It's like his face and then there's also this little image of the back of him and I'm like, I like both the front of him and the back of him. So I'm like, let me get that, you know? And I love to get merch with states in the back of the shirt or like hoodie because I feel like if it doesn't have the, the like tour dates, then it's not like a tour merch. You know what I mean? I don't know if I'm making any sense. And then this is what I got from my mom. It's cute. It's cute. And now the tour dates in the back. And then I was gonna give me a poster, but they didn't have one. I want to take it to my collection. Today was a freaking W. My mom keeps saying on the drive here, and literally right now, she's been saying, Oh my god, oh my god, I see Nelly, I see Nelly. And she's like, Oh, I forgot to tell you this part. Right after Kate, no, not Kane. Right after Nelly like, left, after his like little part, like he didn't stay for like that s full song. He like, after his part, he like actually like left in the back. And then she's like, she looked at me at first and then she's like, oh my god, no way. I think I recorded that part. And then I stopped recording and then she was like, literally like, I could tell by like how she looked like. It looked like she wasn't okay. Like, it was actually really scary in the moment. She was like breathing hard, shaking, doing this, and like crying a little bit. I mean, I didn't really see her, but like I seen a little bit of tears and like it looked like she couldn't breathe and she was about to faint that was actually really scary so i don't think i was word words i don't think i was recording that part but yeah just to like update you guys on that nothing happened she just like was shaking and like breathing heavily and 
all that and like was like you know that's how much you know she likes she loves what's his name nelly i hope you guys enjoyed stay tuned for more concerts videos i have one more plan for this year no actually i'm going to kenzie ziggler and mckenna grace in two days but i'm not gonna be vlogging that just because i don't know what to title that and it's just like gonna be like a short anyways whatever so my next like big concert will be i'm not gonna tell you what it is but i only have one plan for this year but i might get more i don't know i just love going to concerts it's my everything i feel like this one i had more fun i was like jumping up and i never really like record me really like at concerts i usually only record the artist but like i was recording me a little bit um but yeah that's how you know i had fun so i'm definitely going to more concerts it's better with going it's better going with someone than by myself so they could like record me from the back end you know see pictures of me but yeah if you guys enjoyed this video like subscribe comment down below the time is currently 2 a.m so i have to go to sleep but if you guys enjoyed this video if you did like subscribe comment down below what other videos you'd like to see next comment down below the cowboy hat emoji and the brown heart emojis like subscribe comment and i'll see you guys in the next video whenever that is peace love and happiness bye